Well, hello everyone. I, uh, starting, uh, starting a new adventure here. I had a friend that was so gracious to actually gift this game to me. Uh, the game in question, of course, is Stardew Valley, as you can see. Uh, really interested in this game, honestly. It seems like a really chill game, from my understanding. Kind of in the same vein as maybe, like, uh, Harvest Moon and, uh, what was the other one? Animal Crossing, of course. So... I'm excited to be able to do this. Uh, I, I'm a little bit anxious because I <laughs> I know my friend is absolutely anticipating playing with me. They're, they're so excited to be able to, to, to do this and yell at me. So, I mean, well, yeah, they're probably going to be yelling at me because I don't know what the hell I'm doing. So let's let's go ahead and start this new adventure. Oh, I got to do a character. Uh, of course, I got to do some more character creation and all that so let's uh let's let me go go through this by myself and then i'll, I'll be right back all right i uh, <clears throat> uh i think I, I got my character how i like it i, I i'm gonna go with the the standard farm for right now because I, I don't know what the hell i'm doing i don't i don't know what challenges all these other ones might face and i i don't know if i just uh I, i'm not comfortable going that route quite yet so maybe we'll do another playthrough where we can try one of the more challenging ones once we get a, a clue about what we're doing because I, I know I honestly I, I know it's supposed to be a chill game but I honestly get really just so anxious about trying to do things right the first time and uh, you know you just gotta you gotta relax and live a little you know and for my very special grandson I want you to have the sealed envelope. Thanks. I'll take it. No, no, don't open it yet. Have patience. Now, listen close. All right, I'm listening. Tell me. There will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life. All right, I feel that every day, honestly. It's getting kind of gruesome and your bright spirit will fade before a growing emptiness. That sounds abysmal. It sounds awful, god-awful. When that happens, my boy, you'll be ready for this gift. Why can't I just open it now? I mean, I'm feeling pretty, uh, pretty weighted. Now, let Grandpa rest. XX years later, is that 20 years later? Joja, join us, thrive work oh he's desperate and nasty terminated oh is that my character oh, he looks he looks sick it's like awful god awful yeah uh huh I understand Oh, is it time? Click. Dear Snake Eyes, if you're reading this, you must be in dire need of a change. The same thing happened to me long ago. I lost sight of what mattered most in life, real connections with other people and nature. So I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belong. Oh no, I skipped through both of them. I've enclosed the deed to that place. My pride and joy. Farm McFarm. <laughs> Farm McFace Farm. <laughs> it's located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast. It's the perfect place to start your new life. This was my most precious gift of all, and now it's yours. I know you'll honor the family name, my boy. Good luck. Love, Grandpa. P.S. If Lewis is still alive, say hi to the old guy for me, will ya? That I will do. I will find this Lewis. This is my life's mission now, is to find this Mr. Lewis guy and give him the biggest hi he has ever... Wait. Okay. Alright. Yep, we're almost at Stardew Valley. 
Okay. Uh. Hello, you must be Snake Eyes. Hello, Robin. I'm Robin, the local carpenter. Mayor Lewis sent me here to fetch you and show you the way to your new home. He's there right now, tidying things up for your arrival. Okay. The farm's right over here. If you'll follow me. Okay. I hope you don't murder me in the woods. Guy's a fucking mess. This is Farm McFace Farm. <laughs> oh god, yeah, I felt the same way, man. This place is atrocious. What's the matter? Sure, it's a bit overgrown, but there's some good soil underneath that mess. With a little dedication, you'll have it cleaned up in no time. Got little cabins and stuff, too. And here we are, your new home. Ah, the new farmer. Well, hello, Mr. Lewis. Hi, I'm, you're the one I need to be saying hi to. Welcome, I'm Lewis, mayor of Pelican Town. You know, everyone's been asking about you. It's not every day that someone new moves in. It's quite a big deal. So. You're moving into your grandfather's old cottage. It's a good house. Very rustic. Yeah, that's... Uh-huh. All right. <laughs> we'll put it that way, right? Rustic? That's one way to put it. Yeah, yeah, see, she understands. Yeah, crusty might be a little more apt, though. <laughs> Rude! Don't listen to her, Snake Eyes. She's just trying to make you dissatisfied so that you buy one of her house upgrades. Uh-oh. She's getting called out here. <laughs> yep. Anyway, you must be tired from the long journey. You should get some rest. Tomorrow you ought to explore the town a bit and introduce yourself. The townspeople would appreciate that. Tomorrow. 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 Oh, I almost forgot. If you have anything to sell, just place it in this box here. I'll come by during the night to collect it. That is not suspicious whatsoever. Not in one bit. Well, good luck. I I will need it, I guess. <laughs> I hope you don't chop me up into bits and put me in the box. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Alright, first day. Let's go. What are we doing? I don't know what I'm doing here. Oh, I got a little present. Hope it doesn't explode. Oh, it's parsnip. Sorry. That's what it was. Yeah. You received 15 parsnip seeds. Here's a little something to get you started. Mayor Lewis. Alright, what's all this click and bit stuff? Oh. I can move my furniture around. I gotta do a little bit of feng shui in here. I don't know what I'm gonna be doing to... Can I rotate any of this? No, that just scrolls through my stuff. How do I... Well, how do I... I guess I want that right there. I would rather have like a greeting rug. Oh, let me put that back on the table. A plant? I don't know where I would... Can't rotate this like whatsoever. Cause I'd rather rotate it personally. Oh my god, I don't know how to do this. That? Uh, where do I want the plant? Plant over there. Can I get on this? Yeah. Okay. Oh. Can even move that. Can I move? Oh, I can move the window too. I think I like how it is though. Energy. I guess that's my health. What's this? Oh, I got my journal. Getting started. If you want to become a farmer, you have to start with the basics. Use your hoe to till the soil, 
then use a seed pocket on the tilled soil to sow a crop. Water every day until the crop is ready for harvest. Well, <laughs> you know I love me some hoeing around, so introductions. It would be a nice gesture to introduce yourself around town. Some people might be anxious to meet the new farmer. I understand, because I am a shut-in. I do not want to go do, go downtown, I promise you. All right, so it looks like uh, there's a lot of cleaning up to do. These are the cabins over here. Can I get to them? Oh wait, I have tools I can use. I'm guessing, what is this? So I got an ax, I got a hoe, watering can, pickaxe, scythe, uh, parsnip seeds. So I gotta put these parsnip seeds down, right? Uh, oh, okay. So you just click. I'll take it. Oh, uh, I get. Oh, I get. Did I get seeds? Mixed seeds? Is that what that is? Oh, nice. I was right. about these cabins over here. Maybe I'll put the cabins too close. I probably should have just like had them off somewhere in another distance or something. Be cool if they're all in their own little little world, right? What's this? Oh, I can interact with it. What is this? Whatever this once was, it's now in ruins. I guess I'll have to figure that out later. Let's see what it does. So there's a cave. I don't know if I want to do that. I don't want to go in there quite yet. Let's see here. More stuff. And I can cut around. I'm gonna clean up around these cabins for my friends. When we, whenever we play later. I, my understanding is this is multiplayer, yeah? So we can have a little bit of fun with each other. <clears throat> is this a path? Like these pebbles are like just the right way. Bonk. Let's clean up a little bit more. There we go. Get this out of the way. Yeah. There we go. I think I'm gonna leave the trees in the front. I don't know. I'll let them decide if they want to take the trees down. I'd rather let them decide that for their own cabins. Oh. Oh, it's because, like, if I point in that direction, it'll do it? It's like bonks. Bonk. Like gets deeper. Let me not stray too far off the path here. Oh, is that a frog? Can I catch it? Is that a thing? Oh no, I cut a tree down. Cut a tree sapling. I'm a cool individual. Terrorizing all of nature. It's another rock. Let's see here. Just keep cleaning up. Oh, let me get the rock. Oh, there's another one. Is this like grass clumps that I'm? What is this? Fiber. a little bit. Is there a way to like redo your inventory? To pause? Oh, I can. All right, cool. <laughs> farm McFace Farm. Oh, sweet. I like that. That's better. 
That is far better. Far more efficient for me. Doom. Doom. cleaning up for right now. What's that? What is, what is that? I don't know what that is. Yeah, I'll let them decide on if they want to the, take those down or not. That's not my mailbox. They really let me know, didn't they? Oh, I gotta do the parsnips, right? Maybe right here. Dunk. Oh. Three. We'll just start with three. I think that's enough for right now. Do that. Okay. Watered. Cultivate and harvest. This is probably going to take multiple days. Almost 4 30. Doom. Thing has got a thud to it whenever you do the the pickaxe. It's crazy. God, what a thud. Some weight to that. Doom. Jesus. All right. Just doing a little bit more cleaning up. Oh. I think I need to go. Go to town. I mean, it's like almost six o'clock now. It's like, oh, give me that. Oh, I missed it again. Wonder how valuable these stones are. I have more stone than wood, which is crazy. I mean, you would think that it would be the other way around, right? But I'm also not chopping down the wood that much. All right. All right. I need to figure out what I'm doing with myself. This is addicting. To be honest with you, going around chopping shit. It's easy to want to just do that. And nothing else. Not one other thing. Doom. Wait. There we go. That's a, that's a beefy sound right there. Not gonna lie. Okay. What is this? Is there something here? Is that like a pedestal or something? What is this? This is a well? No. Okay. Well, all the music stopped. Oh, it's getting darker. That's mildly concerning. Do I need to... What's this over here? Snake eyes. Wait for my return on the dawn of your third year. Grandpa. Does that mean he's coming back? He's not. What? What's he doing? Like, what happened to him? Three years. <clears throat> That's a lot of time. Some more of these stones while I'm at it. I guess I need to be heading back to my cabin. It's getting kind of late. 
It's almost nine. That's crazy. Go to sleep for the night. Yes. Well, all right. Uh, that was my first little day, first intro. I think um, I think I'm gonna call it on that one. I, I'm gonna go ahead and get prepared for uh, playing with my my friends. Maybe they'll be able to help get me caught up on a lot more things. I, I definitely have a lot of work to do with cleaning up uh, uh, cleaning up around the place. You know, I think I did a pretty good job right here in the front yard. So we'll see what else is going to happen. Oh, I got some mail or something. Anyway, uh, we'll we'll see what's going on in this uh, this next adventure once we once we get my friends online with me. So thank you for tuning in. I really appreciate you and uh, love you guys. We'll see you later.